All right, now we're doing 8Q Convert to Binary. This is by Jeppa X, and 90% of the people like it. Given a non-negative integer in, write a function to binary or to binary, which returns that number in a binary format. All right, so put it in a binary. That's what it does. Example, example. All right. So for this, we're going to be using the number dot prototype dot two string method, and the two string method returns a string representing the specified number object. All right. So this is the syntax we're using: is the two string and then the radix. Now, if you don't know what radix is, here's the Wikipedia for it. But basically, uh, it's just the base of the numbers of the base of the number of unique digits. All right. So usually we use base 10 in, uh, you know, 1 through 10 is our base system. Uh, sometimes you can do 1 through 12, which is duodecimal, blah, blah, blah. And this one, we're going to change it from decimal to binary, which is this one right here. All right. And uh, let me show you what I'm talking about. So we're going to say in dot two string and uh, two right there because we want it binary. Actually, let me set this up right. Let me set this up correctly uh, for JavaScript specifically. So we're going to say, again, we're going to say in dot two string two, right? But that's going to give us a string, right? So test it out. Okay, cool. So it's a string. So what we need to do to change it back to a number is use this unary plus sign which the unary plus operator precedes its operand and evaluates it to its operand, but attempts to convert it to a number. So that's what we're doing. We're just gonna convert it to a number, all right? So we push plus in front of this, just like thus. Test it out. Looks good. Attempt it. Looks good. Submit it. All right, my solutions. Best practice for us and I very much like this one and we'll see you next time.